That mono white deck seems like a fun fucking time, you know what I mean? A lot of complex play, a lot of, a lot of battle displays. Doing quick fights. I guess I just like aggro decks in general, huh? Ford in the woods. Oh, I've seen that card before. I played limited in that set. Bam. Here we go. Oh, hey, we played more white cards. One day I'll get that quest. One day. The future awaits, you know what I mean? Ready. G U I. This is a Yorian deck? Okay. This hand's not awful. It's a nice Ornithopter. That's really cute. I wish I could get one of those. But the event to probably buy them is probably up, huh? Can you imagine flying an Ornithopter? I know Thunder uh, has uh, told me that he wants to get his pilot license one day, but like... Flying an Ornithopter is so much more cool. Bam! Here we are. That's a nice swamp. Um, is there unlikely to have creatures? Maybe I just lead with uh, Fervor Champion, huh? Bring him down to a quick little 15. Flame Duck Arise. It's going good today. Ooh. Wrath Protection. Actually, this isn't really Wrath Protection because it's an odd to our evens. I guess Removal Protection a little bit. Force them to use removal pre-combat. Yeah. And then we only attack them for one. Force them to use removal before our annex dies. Here we go. Oh, a cultivate. That's a sick cultivate. I want to get a foil of that cultivate for my cube. Wow, uh, first time faceless saving has uh, fucked us quite a bit. Anyways, just uh, ate this guy. Or er, nine him. That's right. Basil Saban is a knight! Bam. They're down to five. <sighs> Annex. Furrin Champion. Basil Saban. Islands. Concede! Will this be our first time at Platinum 1 with four pips? Only time will tell. Uh, just board in all the creatures, yeah? Board out an Ember Cleave, uh, board out these Frostbites, fuck them, and in we go. Do we want to keep the land, maybe? Now we've boarded in a lot of high drops. Oh, Hamburgy. These Rimrock Knights can go eat shit. Bam. Good to go. Oh, well. Gooey is still sideboarding. <laughs> I'm a fucking nerd. You should play Mono Red. It requires less thought. I can see you don't have a brain because your uh, your head's kind of being turned into ash as we speak. You asexual uh, demon, I think. I don't know. I don't even know what uh, what race Ashiok is. It's like it's crazy. I'm not that lore heavy. Here we go. Just gonna watch the little thing rotate. Rotate like a pro. Mm hmm. One end, other end, one end, other end, one end, other end, other end, one, one end, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go grab a drink real quick. Damn. Oh, sorry. I'm not gonna go grab a drink real quick. <laughs> They're deciding who's gonna play first. Man, I guess I could drink some of this water, right? Don't die. I'm actively trying not to die, Papayas. I actively try every day not to die from my own uh, idiocy. <sighs> this hand is way, like, best hand I've ever seen. 
Uh, one of the most annoying things I ever hear people say at magic tournaments. This hand would be great for Hearthstone. Yeah, no shit. Every hand without lands would be great for Hearthstone. You just get to play all of your good cards for free. Like, what do you mean? Of course this hand would be great for Hearthstone. <laughs> it's like Hearthstone, but with like... Five more fucking lands. Or, but you get... Four more extra cards in your hand. Like, holy shit, dude. Bam. Swamp. Maybe if we draw a land, we can have, like, the dream start. All haste creatures into Torban. Into getting our ass wrathed. Gonna kill it? Kill it, I dare you. Fucking do it. Do it. 1v1 me, Gyu. Gu gooey. Gooey. Ah, eliminate. I was hoping for a heartless act, but can't win them all. Phoenix of Ash. Cultivate. Bam, bam, bam. And they get two lands, one into their hand, one onto the fucking uh, battlefield. Going good. Oh, wait, I need to play land before I can play a Phoenix, huh? And then they extinction event us, naming Odd, and then we cry into our hands. Uh, how how could they have the wrath? What are they doing? Playing a control deck with eight wraths in it? Oh, no wrath, just to cultivate. Things are going good. They have the sick Godzilla lands. I wish I could afford these Godzilla lands. They're like fifty bucks a piece, my dude. Okay, well, Torman, get in there. Oh wow, they have no instance. Nice. Now they're just a uh, eight. We're just gonna we're gonna bone crusher them, and then we're gonna turn them in, in, on the like slow burner. You know what I mean? Kyora, uh, best of sea gods. Actually, they're just dead. This motherfucker's just dead. The madman did it. He killed him. Fucking uh, Phoenix Smash, get in there. We did it. Fucked up that Yorion deck. Bam. We're still platinum tier four, but you know, you gotta work your way up. You gotta work your way through middle management to to number one. That's how it works. The way up. 100%. Hey, Will, you still here? I want to ask you a question about how the uh, about how the reset works. Bam. Fucking island, snow-covered islands. Okay, we're fighting a banana. Let's do this banana. You playing yellow? You playing a yellow deck? Yellow would of course be the combination of... Uh... Wait, how do you make yellow? I know blue and yellow make green. And so red and orange, or red and green? Red and green. Red and green. He has to be playing red and green because he's yellow. Um, which is really weird for his Yorion deck, you know what I'm saying? Oh, this frostbite's really bad. Uh, <laughs> I wonder if Arena still has like the, the really bad uh, reset where it's a hard... Uh, it's, it's like a hard reset and like even if I Mythic I go to like gold 3 or whatever. Or silver 3. Or if it, they've updated it, so now if I'm Platinum 4, I go down to, like, Gold 3 or whatever. Well, that Heartless Act was kind of a bitch, and I really wish our opponent hadn't done that. It was very mean of them. Whoa, another Heartless Act. Can we draw a land, please? I would really like some lands. Lands are my favorite pastime. Nom 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 nom. Eliminate? Sure. That's not a fucking land, and you know it. You know it, game. Bam. Rimrock Knight. Slap in the face. Bam. Play a Rimrock Knight. They don't have any lands. We don't have any lands. We're still winning. Our deck does better with less lands. Oh, they played a land. We're, uh, we're now in panic mode. Oh my god, oh my god, how do we win? Um... Okay, I have an idea. 
what we do? We Rimrock Knight this boy. Right? We six him. Six him like a real pro. And then we play this Bone Crusher Giant. So the next turn we can eight them, bring them to three, give them a little hope, and then we can attack them with this Faceless Haven, you know? It'll be a valiant effort all the way, through and through. Bam. Little Puppo. It's a Legion Puppo, though. Are you dead? Are you dead, Banana? See, this is because you didn't play green or red. It's the only reason you lost this game. Definitely not because you didn't draw fourth land. Bam. Okay, rolling vortexes, scorching dragon. No, wait. Why would I board him? Scorching dragon cards. That's right. Um, Bergy, Phoenix, Paladins, Goldspan. Fuck this card. Fuck that card. Fuck that card. In we go. Ready to dive deep on this one. Does the background never change in between three games? It's a little, uh, that's interesting, I guess. I don't, like, I, it's actually not interesting. It's, I wish it would change because there's such, so much cool art to see. And they're just like, hmm, how about you really go one? How about you look at one art and then you our time? You are a fucking idiot, so you don't deserve art. Is Karn's book made of silver too? Because it was reflective like it was. That'd be weird as shit. Oh man, our opponent can't decide whether they want to play first or draw first. Oh hey. I wonder if I should mulligan this hand. Dude! I could play a land every turn? And then turn 6 and Ember Cleave! Unbeatable. Unbeatable, just turn 6 Ember Cleave. Uh, this is fine. Uh, bye bye, Oxboy. It was sad to see you go, but you literally cost 5 mana, and I only have 2 lands. Come on, no land pass. That's the dream here. Well, they played a land, so our dream has been shattered. I have to get ice cream to cheer myself up later. Are we gonna eat the banana? Or will the banana destroy us? Okay. Let's go, Robber. No removal spell. And we got a Yorion. I mean, they've only got eight removal spells in their uh, 80 card deck, so it's like 1 to 10 ratio. I mean, I have no way, no way how many they actually have, but. No land pass. Oh god, cultivate. Elspeth's Nightmare? What is this wacky and fun deck? There's no Emergent Ultimatum coming out of these lands. Well, there, one might come out of this land, but not out of this land. Oh man, look at my hand. You can choose any of these you like, and I'll give them to you. Oh wait, you can't choose any of them. Because <laughs> they're all creatures and lands. What a bad card. What a bad card, you know? Literally unplayable. Ooh. Oh, come on! Binding of the Old Gods? What are you doing, man? Come on, play play worse cards. Really, that's... That's your fucking problem, is you keep trying to play good cards on me. Two Sagas in a fucking row? I don't think they're playing blue at all. Oh no, yeah, they are. They have a Zagos Dragon. They have to be. Little do they know that if I attack with this Faceless Haven- Okay, well, that's a bitch. If I attack with this Faceless Haven, I actually get to cast the Yorion, because it's a rogue. Hey, hey, hey. Can, uh... Get- <laughs> Get wrecked, nerd. <laughs> I have a rogue knight. Yeah. Oh no, look at my lands, yeah? <laughs> Guess I'll die. Two Elspis Nightmare. Into a binding of the old gun. Oh, they're playing Doom Foretold? Well, what's that shit? 
guess I'll sacrifice this Elspeth's Nightmare, huh? They stop on my upkeep for some reason? Okay. Um... Yeah, I'll just, uh... It's, uh... It looks like they're probably gonna win this game. Like, um... Uh, this Doom foretold about the pop-off. Spirit of our mountain. What the bone crush of the night. They don't have to sack anything to it, ever. They discard a card, lose to life. You draw a card, gain to life. Made a, make a 2-2. Two -two. And you sacrifice Doom foretold. Cool. Well, our Doom has been foretold. This banana has wrecked us. Doom foretold, but it's a giant... The, the apocalypse is a giant banana. <laughs> Sounds like a good time. Uh, yeah, I'll discard the snow-covered mountain. It's a bit one. Uh, yeah, sure. Um... Let's just kill that. And while we're at it, we can play this Annex. Hard in the Forge. Yep, they're gonna remove it. We're gonna get a 1 1 out of the deal because we're cool as shit. Um, the Doom Foretold is actually pretty good against our Roiling Evil, huh? Or Roiling. something? Fuck. The red card that pings them every turn. Our bad sulfuric vortex. That's what I'll go with. Are they just gonna sack this? God, my uh, my hair knots are uh, really painful to try and untangle, but it's really fun to do. So uh, <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing it. Yesterday I finally went out in uh, my shield profile and I caught uh, Reggie Steel and uh, Reggie Rock. I didn't get the Reggie Ice yet, though. Uh, the only one I actually need is Reggie Alight, because I traded all of them over from Sword. I'm just really excited to like find out where I'm supposed to find like Reggie, Reggie Gigigas. Oh uh, yeah, let's do this uh, correctly, actually. Faithful Haven. Are they gonna kill it? Please don't kill my dude. I would prefer if you didn't kill my dude. But, like, I guess it's up to you. Okay, well. That was a little rude of my opponent to not take my consideration in, into a uh, into wish. Is it? Okay, Papayas. When you say something like, is it? I, I kind of feel like you need to elaborate more. Just saying, uh, just saying, is it? Question mark is kind of like really flat, you know? You could be talking like a trillion things. I'm talking like a mile a minute and you, you're just like, is it? No. Oh, my bad, sorry. Um. Um, I don't know where to go from here. I was talking about you pulling the rats out of your hair. There's no rats in my hair, they're knots. I don't, like, I'm not, like, feeding rats in my hair. That'd be weird as shit. I just, you know, there's just sometimes knots because of, like, how I sleep. Which is, like, a normal human being. And in a bed. Ooh, Omen of the Sea? Oh, there, so this uh, this Yorion is gonna be like, Scry 2, draw a card, times 3? That's a, that's a sick Yorion. I wish my Yorions were that cool. Normally when I play Yorion, my Yorion is a uh, 5 mana 4-5 with no abilities. Not even flying. All of their Pokemon have flying, so it's completely meaningless. I can't believe some people that like rats live in their hair. Do you have like a rats in your hair problem, Papayas? Like, because that seems like really specific for you to like bring it up. Oh, okay. Well, hey, here's Roiling Vortex. Like a trillion turns too late. Um, bam. Roiling Vortex. That's what it's called. Yes. Okay. Well, how do you get rats in your hair? Are you like? Are you feeding them rice or something? Like, I don't know. Did you give them your tofu for lunch? Like, it seems really weird that you would, like, uh, 
make like your hair a rat home. You know what I mean? I'm just dead here. Like, why, why am I even playing? He's gonna just, like get five fucking Pegasi. I feel I I would know. I mean, there's no reason to put the blame on me, my dude. This is probably better than a Rimrock Knight. No, that's better than one. We only have like one glass casket. Or we only saw one glass casket. Oh, these are. Yeah, these are better than Roiling Vortexes now that we know they're playing Doom Foretold. Why not? Because I'm not the one who has small animals living in their hair. You, you know what I mean? Like, that's kind of your problem. You made your rat nest, now explain it. As the famous saying goes. Well, I mean, I do. Hmm. They're the nuts in your hair. What are you talking about? Yeah, I have knots in my hair. I don't have rats in my hair, though. That's really annoying. Um, with the form blight, binding of the old ghost, sure. I mean, I'll play this to just draw a card, I guess. Oh, this is all land types and abilities? That's annoying. Ah, Faceless Haven, there we go. It's still a snow permanent though, right? <sighs> Rats, knots, two sides of the same coin. Yeah, well, actually, I don't believe so. I believe I get my knots through natural occurrences and that you've trained rats to live in your hair. Like... One of which is an astounding feat, I'll give you that, but... Is not the same thing as having a little bit of a tangled hair. You know what I'm saying? Um, hope they don't play a land, uh, I guess, is our play. Oh, they played a land. Damn. Hey, we won the game where they didn't play a land every turn. Like, uh, main phase of Sanix. These Bone Crushers are like dead weights. No, they're the same thing? Rats and not. I don't know if you understand Lexicon. Maybe we need to get, like, uh, Sir Lexicon in here. But, like, rats are small furry creatures that steal human food. Knots are things you tie with ropes and sometimes with hair. This isn't, like, fucking rocket science. It's fucking hair science. Hairology, as some may say. Well, hopefully he doesn't just, like, lead off with a Doom Foretold, you know what I mean? Because that would be kind of the pits. Ooh, is he just one-blocking? That'd be really funny and really bad. No, no. He double-blocked. Cool. Done. I believe out of the two... Of us, I would be the hairologist. What do you mean? I've dyed my hair more. That's the only. Uh, that's the only qualification. Is having your hair dyed. That's how you determine a better hairologist. So, that's not true. Hmm. How many times have you dyed your hair? Like, your actual hair. Uh, draw land. Nice. Bam. Slam dunk. At least once. Mmm. You're gonna have to prove that to me. 
I have not seen the picks, and therefore it did not happen. Oh, they're getting a forest. They still seem to be, uh... No, they're not stuck on four. That was a stupid thing to say out loud. Oh, a Yorian? Well, that's a little bit of a bitch. Oh, hey, they're gonna get to kill our... Our Goldspan Dragon, huh? Hmm... This has gotten very bad, very quickly. Resolve. Everything comes back. We're targeting non-land permanent. Okay. Resolve. Oh. Uh, yeah, two times red. I was an emo teen. Uh, my dude, I had streaks in my hair. Oh, that sounds really cool, actually. Now I actually want to see the pics. Uh, I don't know what other proof I could give you. Picks. I've I've explained this a couple times. I think I've, I've said picks out loud like multiple times. Two. Oh, I didn't get a gold. Oop. Well, I guess I'll just slam these guys down, huh? Army of death. Oh, I should have attacked because that's right. The fucking thing makes the mana too. I don't think I have any. Well then, I will accept all previous times you dyed your hair with streaks if you dye your hair with streaks again, and I get a pick then. You know what I'm saying? No. Ne I... Sounds like you've lost the argument. I guess you're not a hairologist then. I don't know what to tell you. Man, I really hope they just fucking literally do nothing and concede. Oh, that's that's the first start to doing nothing. Okay, well, that's bad. Would you like me to dye your would you like to dye your own hair next time? Um, no, I would very much appreciate your help. Why? This seems completely unrelated to the conversation we were just having. <laughs> then I suppose I am the herologist? Um, I have a, uh, hmm, I don't know how to argue against this, uh, you're, you're like not using logic, you're just, you're just being mean at this point, like. Sure. Then they take six, and they go down to four. The Binding of the Old Gods goes away, so they can't Yorian it. You're just like gatekeeping me from hairology. Have you ever seen r slash gatekeeping? I mean, because that's you right now. Extinction event? Odd. Yeah. Are they still dead? I feel like... Oh no. We need a, we need to draw a land to kill them. Oh wait, no, they're still dead. If they don't have a removal spell, we can activate for four and then chalk for two. Or activate for three. Yeah. Oh, you can be a hairologist, just not the hairologist? Well, that sounds like pedantics, my dude. Are you trying to make a pedantics argument with me on stream where I've been arguing pedantics for the past, like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes? Because that seems very rude of you. And by rude, I mean entirely reasonable. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what else to say except fair. Fair and valid. Yeah, we fucked this game up when we didn't play the Ember Cleave on the earliest possible turn.
Now they're just gonna gain like a trillion life and all that shit. We need one more mana to be able to uh, equip Embercleave and do the good thing. I mean, even the character I have on my shirt is known for their afro, right? So really, I'm the expert hairologist. I, I have double duty. I both have dyed hair, and I have a hair person on my shirt. Like, I don't know how you could beat that. Okay, Shieldbreaker, I believe in you. Do your stuff. <sighs> I can braid hair in at least three different styles. Okay, no need to show off, my dude. Does that count for something? Yeah, fine, you're the hairologist. You win. You've broken my soul. I no longer believe in myself. Are you happy? Is this the outcome you wanted? Oh, okay, yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, bye, Amber Cleave. Um, JK, lol. Bye, Lithoform Blight. Now we say bye to the Amber Cleave, eh? Oh, okay. Well, I'm not having fun playing against this opponent, so fuck them. <laughs> oh man, another hour of magic? Have I scheduled too much magic? Am I having too much, uh... Too much magic time? <laughs>